So. <laughs> you can go at any point. Uh, are you just going to spin in circles and make our audience sick? <laughs> okay. Do I need a takeover? No. Okay. Oh, uh, that's fine. That's on a coup, I leave. Right, and that's exactly what you were doing this entire time. Yes. It was not just you. So, yeah, you know, a super secret walkthrough tip for... Yeah, you spin in circles a lot, like this. And then you find a coupe leaf. And then you find a coupe leaf, just like... Like that. <laughs> I already did it, though, so you can't do it a second time. Yeah, it. you can't ever repeat it, ever. Yeah. Which, and I mean, how did like we know about it? There's a 1% chance of it happening anyway. Yeah. I'm just really special. This, however, we did this last time. Yes, I yes, know. we did. But it's so fun. Oh, and I need it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you do. Oh, shoot. I'm really struggling over here. There's something behind I that know. one on the right. Yeah, it's a sleepy sheep. Oh. What, what do the sleepy sheep do? Um, you have an opportunity to um, set your enemies to sleeps. Hmm. Oh, this one's a honey syrup. Oh, it was an item. Okay. I thought you meant like it was a sheep character that was sleeping. Oh, no. I apologize for the... Oh, dang it. I knew that was coming, too. <laughs> oh, oh, I can't <clears throat> throw it. Gosh dang it. You can't throw what? I couldn't throw my hammer. I'm sorry. Um, because I didn't have any... Oh, FP. FP yeah. I don't have no FP. P. I don't have no F. P. <clears throat> Power show! <laughs> uh, did you like that one, Mario? I used my power oh, show ability. I block you. I block you. Did it? Did I block you? Yeah. The the power shell The power shell ability was great, but why did your voice change so much? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, Mario. My voice didn't change at all. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, 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 What are you... Oh, 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 and da, 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 da. Special power, do, do. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Smash him with your hammer! Ah, oh, oh, you almost got him. Ah. Oh. Hmm, what should I do? I think maybe the jumping others. on them will be a bad idea, but... Right jar... Or the sleepy sleeps. That doesn't really help me at all. Nope, not really. I guess I'll hit it with my hammer! Good night! Uh, so hopefully... Here we go. I'm gonna do a shell toss! Why... Does he become, like, super-powered <laughs> when... Oh, I, got I, by the cutie cats. I, I I don't know what you're talking about. Nothing happens with my voice. Why do you keep insinuating <laughs> something happens with my voice when I attack? Thank you, Nut. Call out to our other series. Oh, oh Mr. Koopa Shell. <clears throat> if I didn't have you, I'd never get through this. Section. Yeah? <laughs> I'd never get through this section. <laughs> I love how it's like you like had a song for a moment, but then you I mean I'm usually really good at the improv twos. It just didn't happen that time. <laughs> oh you blocked it completely. Does it yeah. only block like one damage or um I think it just kind of depends on the strength. I think it can block two. Hmm. It just depends on like how it, like exact it is or whatever. Um, no, I don't think it's really that. I think you either do it or you don't. But I think it's how many you can block. It depends. I don't know. Okay. Sorry, I don't have an answer for you. I mean, it's fine. 
Yeah, you got two health points back. Yeah, there were hearts on the ground. Sometimes they get hearts. That's handy. Yeah, instead of coins, sometimes they spew out flower power or hearts. I feel like there's something with this tree. I don't know. I failed. Are you okay? FP. I need to put my next points into FP. Shell toss! <laughs> Seriously, dude, what is going on? I don't know what you're talking about. You need to stop pestering me, though. Um, hmm. Which one was the left button? Yeah. yeah. I, I love it, or I love that when it's Mario's turn, he just sits there like, Hmm! What should I do? I have so many flying icons in front of me! <laughs> you know, I've never really thought about how strange this is. Oh. Where are these images even coming from? The mushrooms. The mushrooms. Like, it, I haven't really paid attention. Is there, like, a mushroom in the lower corner or something? No. Or just are you just, just insinuating up. things about Mario and I'm his just habits? Things about Mario and his <laughs> Go away. You just... You gotta... Uh, yeah, do that. I'm gonna do you. Ooh. <clears throat> Can you not get there yet? Nope. But I just remembered who we get in this next place. Is it a bomb mom friend? She's pink. It's a bombanita friend. Bomet. A bomet. <clears throat> I'm gonna so, have to think of a voice to give her. Yeah, you definitely are gonna have to do that. Oh no! <laughs> I went in for a wild of hat. Um. Whew. So we were watching SpongeBob earlier today because I'm five. I mean... And the new episode is out on Hulu. Yeah. And in one of the episodes, they had those, like, um, bead things that are on a wire uh, that we had, like, as kids. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh, yeah, like, like little toy things. That yeah, yeah, they were yeah. on, like, a... I guess a more accurate description would just be, like, a, a bent yeah, piece like of a pipe, almost. Yeah, 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 yeah. Those things. I was just thinking about how... Oh, no, 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 no. And I... Oh, man, it took away star points. I forgot about that. Oh, that's crappy. Um, <clears throat> but anyway, so I was like, wow, what a blast from the past. How fun those were, even though they were literally just pieces of wood stuck in, yeah, with yeah. like, you know, a, a pipe wire thing and, in you know, in one and corner and then in another and it just does all these loops and twists in between. But it was between. so much fun. Yeah. And then it got me thinking about how all the <clears throat> different toys that I had, like, as a kid. Yeah. And I don't think I've ever asked you what was your favorite toy, not, not video game, obviously, oh, favorite, favorite toy, toy as a kid. I think it would kind of depend on, like, which point in my life we're talking about. Because when I was really little, I was super obsessed with Crash Dummies. Yes, um, we had Crash Dummies. Like, I had a whole bunch of Crash Dummies. I had... Um, like some of the cars that you could get to go with them. Like I had a taxi that would like, you know, you could crash it into stuff and it like the hood would crumple and the wheels would pop off, airbags would deploy and like the roof would pop off and everything. It was super cool. Very cool. Um, <clears throat> and then, you know, I mean the crash dummies obviously like would, um, you know, like if the button on their chest was hit, they would explode and everything. Um, it, I, there's part of me that's curious whether or not, like, those... I don't know if it was ever, like, a TV show or if it was just, like... Crash Yeah, or if it they was just... They were still the show. 
I, I just couldn't remember if it was actually a show or if it was like a straight to VHS kind of thing. No, there was definitely a television show. Okay. Well, there's part of me that is super curious about whether or not that is actually like a good show or if it was just one of those things where I was like too young to realize how, how terrible it was. It was. Yep. Um, but yeah, um, no, for, for, for a little while it was Crash Dummies, um, and during that same point in time it was, um, Jurassic Park toys as well. Ooh. I didn't have m very many of those, um, oh, but I had, <clears throat> I had like a, a Jurassic Park jeep kind of thing that had like this net attached to it that would mm -hmm. like swing forward and you could like capture dinosaurs with it and everything and then i think i had like a velociraptor and a couple of of like the human character action figures um nice wow. oh they are all very angry now yeah. um so do now you have a fire flower or anything no <clears throat> so now i have to make a decision how many times to blow up? <laughs> yeah. It'd be nice if they could... Uh, I was gonna say it'd be nice if they could, like, chain reaction or something, but... Oh, uh, that's so sad. <laughs> um... Are you sure no. you're losing star points? No, I was realized after that time that I wasn't. Okay. Um, I thought that I was last time. Yeah, I think that might just be like them exploding in star points. Yeah. Oh, Maybe. Um. So anyway. But yeah, no. So I had uh, some of those, but like pretty much a, a a pretty common staple in terms of toys that I had was. Something that was essentially projectile based, um, whether it was lasers or Nerf guns or something like that, because um, around the same time that <clears throat> um, I was really into Crash Dummies, like my older brother and I, like we both had like our individual Nerf guns and we would have Nerf gun fights in our bedroom because we had a big bedroom, um, like it was. Uh, the two slash three of us uh, sharing a bedroom. Um, uh, but, like, we would have, like, you know, the two bunk beds, and then uh, my littlest brother would have, like, his, you know, crib and or toddler bed, like, over in another corner and everything. And there were a few times when we were really young where it's, like, he would go and, like, uh, make a fort, like, on the top bunk of the bed or something. Um... You have a few mushrooms. What's the thunderbolt do? Uh, it deals a lot of damage to one person. Oh, so it'd be good for like bosses and stuff. Well, it's not that much damage, but oh. yes, it is. that is something that I typically will stock up on before I go to a boss. Gotcha. Um, but no, so <clears throat> oh, you can't use shell powers on other turtles. Well, you can if it's a special one. Oh. Like, I can knock them down, and that'll make it... Yeah, happen. and when they're on their back. Yeah. Um, but no, so my older brother would, like, make a fort or something, like, on the top bunk of the bed, and then, like, I would, you know, go downstairs and get, like, all the couch cushions and make, like, this fort by the door to our bedroom. Awesome. And we would just <laughs> have, like, these wars where we, like, I had, like, this big, like, bazooka thing that shot, like, little balls, and then... Um, he had, like, a bow and arrow, uh, that shot the big old darts or something. Um, so we would have wars, uh, with that, and then we ended up, um, let's see, we ended up getting laser tag stuff, I think it was short, well, no, probably not shortly after. Uh, maybe a year or two, maybe three, after we moved to Indiana. Mm -hmm. um, we got laser tag stuff, and then I was obsessed with that for a long while. Um, like, even to the point where, uh, <clears throat> like, the second place that I remember us living in Indiana 
was uh, like this ranch style home, but like there was um, like a bedroom or like the bedroom area kind of like looped back around into a second bathroom and then into the kitchen. Mm -hmm. So like it all kind of made this loop. Um, so we would play laser tag in there all the time. And we had like this like time bomb kind of thing and like a big, you know, like a big rifle and a couple pistols mm -hmm. and everything. It was so much fun. So did you guys ever have one of those Stretch Armstrongs? Uh, no. I had a friend that had one. Those are the coolest! I obviously did not have it because my mother would never have purchased me a boy's toy. Yeah. But, um, it was my brother's and we played with that thing all the time together. And, man, you can do nothing except this and waste my flower powers. Um. Oh, hey, you hit him. Yeah, because it was the special one, but it wasted my flower power because it was just one. Oh. Because it would get all of them on the ground. Yeah. Um. I was just hoping that the other guy would fall on his back. Yeah. Like that, but he didn't. Gotcha, gotcha. Um. But anyway, so, like, my favorite toys growing up were, um, Polly Pockets. Mm hmm Made no sense at all. Have you ever seen a Polly Pocket? Uh, yeah. I, I actually had some similar toys as well, but they were, like, uh, like the Micro Machine kind of oh, things. Oh, I didn't realize that they made a dude's version. Yeah. I mean, I'm not shocked, but, like, <clears throat> they looked like little makeup console things. Yeah. And it had little teeny tiny plastic dolls. I mean, no bigger than my pinky yep. nail. Like, yeah. why? 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 Why did we like these? <laughs> But uh, I loved them. Yeah. And then I had, um, I was all about, like, fairies and mermaids. Mm-hmm. Uh, ooh. Ooh, dang. Um, so I had these fairies that were projectiles, actually. They were absolutely awesome. They, um, you put them in this little, like, wind-up toy, and it, um, their arms were, um... I think I know what you're talking about. <gasps> it's like, you would have, like, the little, like, platform that they were on or whatever, and you'd pull the string, they'd go flying up. And yeah! Like, yeah! They were the coolest! Yeah, I remember commercials and stuff for those. They were amazing. Oh, shoot, I can't even oh, hear yet. Oh, hey! You know what we never did? What? Ended the episode. Well... We're like five minutes over. We're really bad at that. This is why we can't have in-depth conversations. Seriously. <laughs> well, next time on, on Freckles and Beans. Bean. 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 Just, just one bean. Just one bean. <laughs>